Ukraine, and on the 20th anniversary of the Chernobyl disaster, three visitors from Glasgow take a holiday detour. I was actually quite surprised how easy it was. It's not a place you'd think of going to as a normal tourist, you know what I mean? So I was surprised how easy it was to do it. The whole place did feel eerie. It didn't it? Because um, we went to Chernobyl Village first, which is, um, which is populated. These are people who moved back um, after the disaster. Uh, they were kind of the last people we saw before we headed into the zone itself. It was kind of nerve jangling at times. Um, the, the, we had the, the soldier from the base, uh, or the scientific advisor, whatever he was, with a Geiger counter. I think uh, no background levels in Kiev about 14, but near the sarcophagus, we number four, it's about 500. That sort of stage, you got a bit concerned. Maybe you shouldn't be there, but it's too late to back out. Amazingly, they're allowed to film this close to the stricken reactor. The main thing that struck me the most about what I saw in Chernobyl was how close we got to reactor number four, 50 metres away from it. That's how close we got. I was surprised how actually close we had to get to the actual thing.